Good morning. Good morning. Uh, Rose already said hello before she realized that I wasn't recording. So I'm not good at this. We're, <laughs> we're getting there. Uh, it is currently 6.58 a.m., so we have to go down uh, to deck five in front of the Java Blue Cafe to pick up the water shuttle pass. Uh, and that starts at seven, so we've got a few minutes to get there. And then we're gonna swing by guest services real quick and ask, uh, since it is Carnival's Island, but it is a Bahamas Island, how the, uh, if they'll allow me to fly the drone, basically. Um, if they won't, then I'm not taking it off the ship. Uh, so we're gonna go do that, and then we're gonna head to breakfast, get lathered up in some sunscreen, and mm -hmm. then head on to the island. Uh, so come along with us. Inside the glass elevators once again, down to deck five. Alright, now let's go get us our water shuttle pass, which should be by the Java Blue Cafe, which is our favorite, I would say favorite little shop on board, because it's got all the coffee. Mm -hmm. And they have really good cold brew, like, um... It is really good. It's, it's really smooth, it's not harsh, like, uh, the... I almost flipped around. <laughs> Even without sugar. Yeah, with it, without sugar, without cream, anything, it doesn't really matter. It is really good cold brew. Um, like, Tim Hortons has really good French vanilla, but their cold brew is just not great. Um, Java Blue has really good cold brew. And we're walking through the casino now, and since it's closed, Let's give you a view. We got the tables, slot machines, more slot machines. Bar. Oh yeah, the bar. And you can smoke in the casino still. Uh, so your, your smoking areas are going to be the casino. And then as long as you are playing, you can only smoke in the casino if you are playing. There's a, a sign on the wall. Uh, and then deck 10 mid on starboard all right i think this is the line boarding passes for the water shuttle acquired and now we are going to guest services to ask our weird question okay so uh, we stopped in at guest services and they uh, and did inform me that no, we are not allowed to fly the drone on Half Moon Keys. So, not taking that out. Now, we are currently sprinting down to the dining room because I hit check in now and uh, it immediately was like, hey, you're on this table. just finished breakfast, now we're back in the elevator again, heading back to the room. Uh, we uh, stopped by the Java Blue and picked up my complimentary bottle of water since I am a gold member of their VIP program. Uh, hang on, I'll flip you around here. Is this nine? Yeah, this is nine. Okay, cool. <laughs> so, <laughs> so, you used to get the bottle of water in the cabin uh, as well as your sailing pen. Um, and a coupon for your drink on your last evening. Uh, however, they do not do that anymore. If you want the pin, you have to go and pick it up at the Pixels Gallery. Uh, and if you want the bottle of water, you have to pick it up at any bar on the ship, but you just go up and tell them Or it's, the coffee place. Or the coffee place, yeah. Uh, and then for the last night's sailing, you just give them your sailing side card. You don't, act, uh, you don't actually get the coupon for the drink, at least not on this sailing. But yeah, we're gonna go back to the room real quick, get sunscreen on, grab our bags, and then head down and get ready for the water shuttle. All right, we are now ready and just came out onto the deck and it is Tally Animal Takeover morning. So let me take you around here.
right, we are now up on deck. Uh, or deck 10, we're already on deck. Uh, but this is Half Moon Key. Hopefully you can see it with the sun in the background. We got our little tender boat coming over, or water shuttle, whichever you prefer to call it. Uh, and over there, directly under the sun, is the little channel that the tenders will go in to drop people off on the island. Uh, last... Let me flip that around. There we go. Uh, last water shuttle back from the island is at 3.15 p.m. So it is recommended that you come back before then because usually they get a fairly long line of people wanting to come back on board around that time. So now we're going to just kind of hang out and then figure out... Uh, when we're getting on the shuttle. We are zone one, so we'll wait till they call it. Anyone in? No. All right, we're gonna hit two. Oh, it's so dark in here. It's creepy high rose. Yes, because I'm with you. No. I mean, that, that's I'm fair. That's it's totally fair. Oh, God, it's light. Oh, no. <laughs> All the way down. Can you imagine having to clean these bowls? Uh, no. No, thank you. Uh, we're going underground. Ah, I'll look the art gallery. All right, this way. <laughs> so, I think we need to. Good morning. Good morning. Right, thank oh, you, oh, you got it. Okay. <laughs> uh oh, looks like we need to. I don't know how we need to go down. That's all closed off here. That's open. So we came down the Ford elevators uh, to deck one. Let me flip around. <laughs> uh, and now they are making us go to the midship elevators because the water shuttle is there instead of the Ford. So we're heading that way now with the group. All right, downstairs we go. Morning. Morning. Do we... Okay, we do have stairs up there. Hi, Rose. Hey. <laughs> I'm nervous if I'm getting an omnibus. Out of the gangway. All right, here's our warnings. Pause and read if you need to. Okay. Oh, got a scan. Uh, I got it. Okay. Yep. Oh, sorry. <laughs> You're good. Okay. Morning. Morning. All right. Horseback riding, eco bike and hike, and snorkel by boat. Was this a real fort that they just painted? I am not sure. Fort San Salvador. I'll have to look that up at some point. So this is going to be morning. This is going to be our little shopping area. We got yep. We got to make a pit stop at the restroom here, which is called Ye Old Washroom. They did not. I've been in that one. Okay. Or I, w I went into that one. Alright, so we just got done with the uh, little souvenir shopping. We had to pick up a beach bag, because uh, I didn't think we would need one, so we didn't bring one, and then we did. 
Uh, but this is a little chapel where you can get married on Half Moon Key. And what better place to get married than in front of the ship out there? Behind that little thatch roof. All right, now we're gonna continue on. Uh, we're gonna head down the beach and explore more. Uh, we're looking for the wish you were here sign, which I know is in front of one of the bars, so we'll swing by that. Go up here around here. It is already blisteringly hot and sweaty. <laughs> yes. The shade, though, from all these nice little trees is helpful. <laughs> yes, this is a nice little walk. We found it. It is by whatever this bar is called. Oh, the I wish I could stay here forever bar. It's on the side. So now we're going to continue on looking for the pirate ship bar. Excuse us. Uh, oh, here's a map. Okay, so we are here. And we're going to continue down. Where's the pirate ship? Ah, oh, right there. Captain Morgan's on the rocks bar. So we got a little bit here. One, two, three, four, five little stops. The food pavilion is between uh, the I Wish You Could Stay Here Forever bar and the Captain Morgan bar. And you got some sports areas. We just passed the little Bahamian church. And then up to the water, ports, water sports center over here. And then beyond. So if you work your way down the to the edge there, uh, you wind up running into a lot less people. We found a friend while walking. Well, we're not getting you. We just, just following. Very slowly. <laughs> Keep going. Keep her going. Oh. We have arrived at Captain Morgan's bar. stained glass window there of Captain Morgan. I'll uh, we'll have to get closer to it to see it. And we got two Bahama Mamas in fun, fun little boys. cups. Yeah. Oh yeah. Look at that. Look at those. Yeah. Okay. We are going to try to find a path down into the trees here on the left. Uh, last time I was here there was a hammock that you could hang or uh, lay in. Hello. Hi. Hello. 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 Uh, nope, still don't see a path. Oh, uh, no, that's that's not exactly a path. All right, we're gonna keep going. We will find one. Uh, we're gonna go over here to the left into the slightly taller trees for shade, relaxing, and beach. Hello. <laughs> that was one of the tours that goes around the island. And we did not book an excursion today. We're just nope. out doing this. But look at the trees. Look at all the trees. Man, that looks like we could go through there. But... Mm. Mm. There should be like a major pathway yeah, kind of thing. Okay, yeah, that too. Maybe. Uh -huh. mm, no. <laughs> That's a no. So we're out here just looking at the ship. It's super quiet. And a little sailboat to the right there is Rose's mom and Don. <laughs> We're just watching them go into the distance. Hi. But let me show you where we are for right now. So we're eh, about halfway down the beach, I would say. So over here is where, uh, way out here, is where the inlet is and the little shopping area when you first come in. And there's the pirate ship bar. And you just work your way down. And it's nice and quiet. You're away from the hustle bustle. And you just get a nice relaxing beach day. In the beautiful clear blue water. So we're going to switch to the Osmo action camera. So we can go into the water. Does that sound good sweetie? Yes that sounds fabulous. I'm so excited. <laughs> That's the plan. And we'll see you. Time to take clothes off. Okay. 
Uh, we'll see you out here. <laughs> Taking Instagram photos. Well, that's what I mean. It's taking so long. Oh, I gotta get the Wait, video going. The oh, well, shut the fuck up. <laughs> Could you? We're getting in the water. Yeah, you can yeah. see that they have raked the beach. Yep. See, this is hard. This is not like that other stuff. <laughs> Yeah, it's a little chilly. Huh? It's a little chilly. Mm -hmm. oh. But once you get in, oh, it feels good. Oh, yes. Yeah. Honey, what's that? A seashell? Sure. Yeah, they're a seashell. Birds. Birds. Bird, bird, bird. Birdie is the word. <laughs> Peaceful. Serene. <laughs> Not serene. Hello. Oh. Cold on my shoulders. But we're in. Look at the ship. Yes. Oh. I love this ocean water. <laughs> So yeah, over here is where all the events are going to be. Uh, so they're going to have, like, a, I believe a volleyball competition today. Uh, sandcastle building. Um, what else? Not the hairy chest, because they got rid of that. Uh, or they haven't restarted that since... I, th I think that's one of those, like, holdovers from the early days of cruising that they are not going to be bringing back. A lot of cruise lines have stopped doing it. Uh, Stop doing what? The Harry Chess Contest. Yeah. I think there's going to be a belly flop competition. Um, I don't Did know what else is going on. Did you ever do the Harry Chess Contest? Absolutely not. <laughs> I am Harry, but I am not. I am not good in front of crowds. <laughs> I don't do well with people. You don't do well with people. It's people. <laughs> we got Rose over here. Enjoying the water. It is so clear. You can see everything around you without a snorkel man. Yeah, like right down there, or down there is a rock. Yep, there's And that's about rock. four feet down right now, so. Super clear. Super clear. Super there's beautiful. Like a seashell or something down there. I think you guys are gonna go under and have a look-see. But there isn't anything aside from like the occasional rock. There's no choice, there's nothing else. That is true. This is very cool. And now it's my turn to go under the water here, so I'm gonna go towards Rose because she's not paying attention to me right now, which is good. Oh, she actually just got under. So here we go. You're right. <gasps> Water and what? <laughs> Go after you. <laughs> it is really freaking clear. And it feels so nice. I'm so glad we went swimming. <laughs> yeah, when it's hot, I always want to go swimming. There's no. What are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> Being silly. I don't know. I can't see the screen. You want to watch? It looks like it's recording. <laughs> we're doing, we're doing the J spin, except you're not looking at me. Oh, look, there's a queen. Is it recording? Yes. Little red light flashing. Yes. Okay, then you go. Your mom and John are on their way back. Where are they at? See the little sailboat. I do see the little sailboat. Let's go underwater. So something that's kind of cool is uh, you float a heck of a lot better in salt water than you do in fresh water. But right now I'm not even having to move and I'm just floating.
Rosa. Hey, Rosa. <laughs> It's after a quick little, there we go, quick little break uh, on the beach. Now we're back in the water. Back in the water. And it is currently 10.21 a.m. So, probably, you know, hour, hour and a half, we'll head back to the ship. Yeah. And grab lunch on board and then relax. At least that's the goal. And uh, maybe, because we already in our swim suits, we can go to Serenity. Yeah, if that's empty. If it's empty. <sighs> Hi, Rose. Hi. You shouldn't get the close-up of me. You were coming near me. I wasn't moving. Look, get the seagull. Okay. Oh, yep, I see the seagull. Uh, right there-ish. Hopefully you can see it. Alright, so Rose is getting out to reapply sunscreen, um, and we found something, we don't know what it is, we think it's a rock, but it could be something else. So I'm going to put you guys down there, and then we're going to review the footage later and find out what exactly this thing is. Yeah. What is it? I don't know, but we will figure it out. I know, if I put... I mean, you might see better if you put on your sunglasses, because they're polarized and it would stop any reflections, but... But, I don't want to bring my sunglasses on. Yeah. Now we're going to go up to the beach, probably dry off, put on some sunscreen, and then maybe head back up front for a little bit. Well, another thing kind of looked like a snake, but it wasn't moving, so I'm guessing it was like a stick. Let's go check that. Too. Just finished on the beach. Uh, took a while to find an actual foot wash, foot wash station. Can't talk right now. Uh, it, was a little crowded. it was a little crowded. People just kind of kept showing up while we were trying to use it. <laughs> so, a couple of tips. Uh, common courtesy for the elevator: wait till everyone gets off. Foot wash station. Wait, wait until, until people the people are done are and done. out of the way. Yeah, um, and. You might want walking shoes for going on, but bring like a pair of sandals or something for the foot wash station because it'll be easier than trying to put a sock on where you have nothing to hold on to. Yeah. Yeah, we wore hiking boots because it's a bit of a distance to the secluded part of the beach where it's you know, quieter. Right. And when we get home, I'm going to have to vacuum mine out. Yeah. <laughs> I know it. So... But yeah, so. But it does make for a comfortable walking, and a lot of the surfaces are slippery when you're getting off the ship. So it does help to have that, like, good hiking shoes, just the washing part of your feet. It'd be nice to have a pair of flip flops. Alright, we're going through. Before trying to put shoes back on. Okay. Oh, Alright. Okay, yeah. so hopefully you caught all that from Rose. Uh, Probably not. Yeah. <laughs> But we're back to the shopping area here, and then we're going to head back onto the ship and go have some lunch. Back to the ship, right here. Yep. Oh. I don't know where we need to be. And we're through security uh, and back towards the ship now. It has been uh, about, oh, there's a foot wash station right at the end. <laughs> uh, it was about, what, 30 seconds to get through security? Mm hmm. Hey, we got one of the, the ones with the ramp this time. Cool. Let's go up top.
back onto the water shuttle now, heading back to the ship. Uh, and the Half Moon Clipper, which you just saw there, uh, the Half Moon Key has no permanent residence. No one lives on the island. So every morning, the crew comes over from uh, one of the, I, I don't know which near Bahama Island it is, uh, but they ride over on the Half Moon Clipper, get everything set up and ready for the ships to arrive each day. And because this is owned, the island is uh, Carnival Corporation and PLC, it also means that all of their subsidi subsidiary lines can use it. So Carnival, Princess, Holland, uh, and I believe one of the queens has stopped in here, I'm not, or a few of them, I'm not quite sure, uh, from Cunard. Uh, I know the, the other lines can also stop in, but they rarely do just because they're not strictly like, you know, week long or two week long vacations. They do a lot of longer ones that travel the world for the most part. Uh, but yeah, so now we're on our way back to the ship. Uh, we're gonna go up to the room, reapply sunscreen, get uh, rinsed off to get all this sand off of us, and then probably hop into the Serenity Pool, uh, since in theory, most of the people are on the island. So it should be a pretty nice day. We'll, we'll swing by and see on our way back. But I'm gonna flip you around again and show you the ship now, because it is over here. Originally, I wasn't a fan of the new paint jobs because Carnival was always the classic white ships, but I like the, I like the blue and red. It kind of grows on you. Just like originally when the Sunshine was uh, modified from the Destiny, I didn't really like the, the two extra decks on top, but it makes it unique. Alrighty. Oh, and that was the boat we rode out on the first time. Uh, or on the, yeah, rode out, uh, which actually is a glass bottom boat. Whereas this one is strictly a uh, ferry or tender or water shuttle, whichever you would like to call it. It's so was... beautiful and the breeze is great. All right, so we are back on board now. Uh, we took our, oh, is that one of them? Yep. I heard it, yep. Go, go, go. Where? 
Uh, oh, never mind. It, nope, hit it, hit it again. Oh, is that one open? Okay. Uh, anyway, so we uh, are back on board. Uh, we alienated our sailing sign at both the security checkpoint on the island as well as on the ship. Uh, and a quick little tip, cheat if you would like. When you get back on the ship, if you're on the forward section, instead of waiting for the elevators on deck zero, walk two flights of stairs up to deck two, oh, excuse us, up to deck two, and then you can grab one of the glass elevators because the glass elevators do not go down all the way to zero, so no one's using them. Great. It was great. We did it by accident the one day, and then we've been doing it every other day since. It works great. You don't have to wait <laughs> on the elevator. <laughs> so we're going to go back to the room, rinse off, and then go up to the pool. So quick update. Um, my rinsed off, put on more sunscreen. Now we're going to go up to Serenity and hopefully uh, get in the pool. If not, we'll find some food, sit down, whatever. Uh, but funny thing, so over here is where I've got all the all the backup drives and the tablet and everything, and Rose was drinking water. And then somehow, I don't know if she choked on it or something, but she managed to spit water on every single one of them. No one, sweetie! Yeah. Anywho, so we dried them off. Uh, they should dry out before I have to use them, and hopefully nothing failed. Uh, but now we're gonna head up to Serenity as soon as she's ready, and then, uh, yeah, go from there. We'll probably be on the Osmo action then for the rest of the afternoon since it is waterproof and this one is not. So, yeah. <laughs> so the water in the pool is very, very cold. Very cold. Ah. Or refreshing, whatever you would like to say. <laughs> Alright, so we're here in the Serenity Pool, uh, as you can tell from the noise in the water park. Uh, we're just kind of chilling for a little bit. Uh, it's currently 11.50 a.m. Uh, the water here is also very cold. It took me a bit to adjust to it. And now Rose is out there in the middle. Uh, but yeah, so we're going to chill here for a little bit. Probably get some food, I would assume, some kind of snack or something here in a bit. Uh, maybe go up to the hot tub up top on, because right now we are on deck 11. Uh, up there at the first level of the water tower is deck 12, and then up above that is 14. 14 is where the hot tub is. So, we'll see how or what we do. Hello. Okay. Uh, so we came up to go to the Whirlpool, um, which is closed. For they're, heavy chlorination. Yeah, they're, they're, they're doing a high chlorine like cleaning of it. Um, Probably because people are out on the island, so they figure... Yeah, they're getting maintenance and stuff done. So we are currently inside a clamshell, uh, as you can kind of see here. Yeah. It's a nice shady spot, it's beautiful, it's relaxing. So, we're just gonna kind of chill here for a bit and then, I don't know, figure it out from there. Maybe get some food. Sure. Even just a little pizza or something is tiny. Pizza, yeah. Pizza would be good. Pizza would be good, or if you want to do guys, because we haven't done that the yeah, whole time. Yeah, guys burger joint. We have not had a guys burger yet. Yeah, and so I feel like you'll to want that. to. Yeah. Yeah, that sounds like a good idea. Mm -hmm. So, we'll sit here for a bit, relax, and then go grab a guys burger. Yeah, and then we flip you around in theory. Wait, how do I? Oh, no, let's just reverse the screens. <laughs> uh, hang on. Pretty sure if I just tap this button. Nope. Do I have to hold it? I have to hold it. Ah, there we go. All right, now I get to the back screen. Yeah. All right. This is our current view. Just got Guy's Burger Joint. Uh, this is the Ringer Burger, uh, and I have added lettuce, tomato, onion, pickle, and a mix of jalapenos, banana peppers, and some other form of pepper. And I've got chipotle mayo to go on top. Uh, maybe ketchup for the fries. 
And Rose got the, what did you get? Plain Jane with the brown sugar barbecue sauce. Is it good? Yeah. Alright, so we're going to enjoy these and then, uh, I don't know, we'll get up to more trouble today. Ah, sorry about the shaky cam. Uh, just finished lunch, so we're now going to go and grab some ice cream. Uh, excuse us. Oh yeah. The swirls. Alright, now let's go find a seat. Hello. Okay, so starting here in about a half an hour, uh, they're going to have the movie Vivo going, which is a Sony animations picture, um, and it's a musical. So we'll see how that goes, but aside from that, the only thing that's actually going on on the ship right now is trivia, which I'm not in the mood for. So we're going to do the movie. We have found a clamshell. So we're gonna steal it. Here? Yep, right here. So we just finished doing a uh, time lapse of the <laughs> of the sail away from Half Moon. Um, let's see, where did we last leave off? Oh yeah, we were we were getting ready to watch the the Vivo movie. Um, we didn't. We didn't. We were falling asleep in the clamshell. Decided to go back to the room and take a nap. Got we up. did. It was great. Yeah. Mark got does up. not nap, so this is extra fabulous. I'm grumpy when I nap. Uh, so. <laughs> So we, we got up, got showered, got ready for dinner, and now we are uh, on the way back to the room, so we're going to put on some makeup. Cause and maybe I, mess with my hair a little bit. A little bit, yeah. But we are in the room, so every ship has an area where they get um, like uh, plaques and awards and stuff for their first time arriving at a port. Um, so that is this room, which is directly off of the pool on 9. Uh, if you're heading forward. So, I'm going to flip you around and show you what it is. So here we have uh, the Eastern Sales Division, the Government of the People of the Cayman Islands, yeah. 
Curacao. And the, oh yeah, and this is called the Carnival Destiny Retrospective Gallery. Uh, so when she was refit in 13 from the Destiny to the Sunshine, this is what she used to look like on the inside. So that's the piano bar there. The old dining rooms. <laughs> the atrium back before it got the, uh, the, the sun and all the shiny ball things. Old deck plans. And then this is after the refit. Uh, we're starting into after the refit. So yeah, this was the old twister water slide, the blue slide. Uh, yeah, and it was open, but now the new one is closed. Yeah. Old spa and everything, and then you got the new sections from... Uh, from sunshine and this is what she looks like now kind of without the glare <laughs> it's not gonna be a really good picture but yeah see it looks like that now yeah that's the ropes course and waterworks yeah. all right let's head back to the room so on some of the carnival ships that have not been refit yet uh, you may still be able to find the old style twister water slide I know Splendor just got rid of hers. I don't know how many are left, though, or if there are any at this point. Oh, excuse me. Hello. All right, so we're heading back to the room. We're going to get Rose ready for dinner. And then, um, go to dinner. Yum. And tonight's plan, we have uh, Latin nights for the show. Mm -hmm. uh, and the mega deck party. Which, now that we've napped, we should go to. Hello. Hello. All right, so we are done in the cabin. Uh, last update was going back to the cabin for makeup. So. Yeah. And it's done. And the hair's done too. Mm, look at all the makeup. 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 Anyway. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> so now we're off to dinner. We're going to the main dining room on uh, the sunrise on the aft deck of three and four. Uh, so depending on what table we get, we'll be heading that way. Uh, we're going to grab dinner, and then at 7 p.m., doors open for the Latin Nights pre-show stuff, and then at 7.30, the actual show starts. Uh, then we've got a nice gap, probably, I'm guessing Latin Nights is going to last about an hour, um, but then we've got a nice gap of from 8.30 to 10 before the Mega Deck Party tonight. So we'll probably open our bottle of wine that we brought yes. in pre-game. <laughs> sure. Because <laughs> we brought the bottle of wine, so we might as well drink it, right? You know? Right. Otherwise, we've got to transport it home. Right. So, no. uh, but yeah, we're going to do that. Um, and then I figure probably once once we're done with Latin Nights, uh, I would like to do some walking around up on the deck for Serenity at night, just because it looks cool as shit with all the lights and stuff. So we'll be going there. And I have the right shoes and a little sweater, so we'll be good. Yep. Alright, so we're gonna go to dinner, and then go from there. Just finished dinner. Uh, now we're heading up front. Oh, announcement. What's up, everybody? This is TJ. I'm just a friendly reminder it's that TJ. we have our first show of Black Nights coming up at 7:30. So don't miss that. That's where we're going. Show. Uh, you can have music, you can hear things, you are 
I, mean, I like this. I don't even have to do the actual talking part. He just does it for me. <laughs> We're heading up there. <laughs> What are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> All right, we got Gene, Don, and Rose, and we're ready for Latin Nights. I'm hoping this is like kind of All right, welcome in, folks. My name is TJ. I'm your cruise director. Everybody say, hey, TJ. Hey. All right, so tonight's show is called Latin Nights. Uh, your play's performers are going to be singing and dancing up here on the stage for you. Uh, just a few things, though. Make sure you keep those aisles and exits clear throughout the entire show. And also, make sure you don't flash our performers with your phones, all right? So make sure you turn your phones uh, the flash off. If you're going to take photo or video, and just keep that camera close by your side. Uh, now, folks, uh, tonight at 10.15, we're going to have your mega deck party under the stars. It's going to be on the Lido, so don't miss out. I'm going to take my pants off. I'm going to see you up there. Put my shorts on. Put my shorts on, all right? Woo! All right, well, folks, it is now time for us to go nuts and go crazy. So make some noise for your players performers in Latin Nights. Come on, y'all. Let them hear it. Let them hear it. on the front so that we can do some stargazing so you may not see much i'll show you it i don't think the camera's gonna pick it up though but you're right i don't have to worry about it all right so we're out here it's dark mm -hmm. there there's rose i don't know if you can see that probably not we're <laughs> gonna look down look at nope stars. you can't see any of that and the, the stars, which looks like a black screen, but we got it. All right. <laughs> Come on, Rose, go back to dancing. You were just dancing. Why'd you stop dancing, Rose? Because I don't want people of YouTube to see my booty. We are back in the room temporarily, and we have our tail animal friend for this evening. Uh, I believe it is a rhino. But we're going to... Oh, here's all the debark info they gave us our little... I don't want to talk about debarking. Well, we'll have to read it tomorrow. No. We don't have to read it. And then we have uh, tomorrow morning at 11 a.m. is the debarkation presentation. Um, so I'll be going to that uh, so we can get all the information of what we need to know before we get off the boat ship. Yep, uh, but then uh, here in a minute, it is currently 8.30. So we're going to go up onto deck nine and ten and walk and walk around uh, and look at the ship in the dark. Dark. And then we have the mega deck party. Um, the pre-party starts at ten and the actual party starts at ten thirty. So we're gonna go do that. Yeah. And Rose is uh, she really liked Latin nights. <laughs> See the conga. Do, do, do. <laughs> she really liked it. <laughs> 
All right, so what did you think of Latin Nights? I love Latin Nights. It was very nice to watch everybody dance and do all that. And it really kind of showed which people they had more singing and more people because they're better at dancing and that you could kind of see who was put into what roles and everybody had really nice costumes and danced very well. And the gentleman who sang uh, the hero song, he started out in Spanish at first and then like saying it in English afterwards, but he did a fantastic job. He has a great voice, so very fun. And it made me want to dance. Do the kind of do 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 do. See, roses have fun. Uh, so we just poured our bottle of wine. Uh, it was Beach Bum. By blend of, blend of seven. By Blend of Seven in Delaware, Ohio. Uh, if any of you have ever been there, it's a pretty good little winery, and they have a good cheese and meat tray, if I remember correctly. Uh, but yeah, so we're gonna drink our wine and tour the deck here in a minute. Jurassic Park. They're the end of Jurassic Park Dominion. Let's see if we can go up top. So we tried to go up to deck 14 through the elevator. Um, we got up there and then they have it roped off where you can't leave. Oh, no, nope, it's closed here too. So they must have it closed for either cleaning or uh, see ropes. Yeah. Uh, they must have it closed for cleaning or because of high winds, so. But, so we've seen this area, we got more this way, yeah. And look, if you look this way, you can see the water. Yeah, it's cool as shit at night. Alright, so we're going to walk towards uh, waterworks in the back of the ship and look around. Sound good? Okay. Down the stairs we go. Light up blue. For tonight, uh, for the minor, we got our last night show coming up at 9. Wait, kids, on kids playing, uh, sports ball. Uh, folks, we got our mega deck party under the stars at 10 15. So, uh, folks, I'll be up there, my fun squad, and the DJ. And we're gonna all have some great music playing for you. So, don't miss out on our mega deck party. It's gonna be lit, so don't miss out. Uh, tonight we do have a midnight movie. It is going to be the unbearable weight of massive talent. So if you missed it before, you can watch it again this evening. That will be at midnight up on the Lido. Uh, now tonight uh, we are going to have our casino open for you to the late hours of the night. So don't miss out. Uh, that's going to be uh, open until the late hours. But folks, they have all the players meeting at 11 p.m. Must be 18 to play. Night club is going to be open for you on tonight's uh, with full power at 11 o'clock. And then DJ Surge takes over at midnight with the latest and greatest hits. Uh, the last reminder for you to our patient presentation tomorrow, be sure to my last announcement. Make sure you join me at 11 o'clock tomorrow morning for our DMARC talk on all the tips and tricks when it comes to heading off the ship in Charleston. It is a sound of demarcation and it's good to know everything, uh, of course, in advance so that we can plan out your day tomorrow and your morning the next day. I'll make your life so much easier. All right, well, folks, we'll see you for the wave uh, morning show at 9 30 tomorrow, followed by our military. for the mega deck party? Maybe. You look tired. I am tired. Even though we took a nap? And had coffee. And had coffee, yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, they're picking up all the chairs for the party. So we'll be ready to 
to get going here in about 45 minutes. Oh God. I don't know if I'm gonna make it 45 minutes. You don't think so? <laughs> I don't, I'm hoping. Should we go get some coffee? Yeah, we should go get some coffee. I gotta stop leaning on the railing. It was shaking all the shit. All right, we're going to get coffee. Okay. We are going to find... Oh, wait, do we have our, our coffee card thing? Not with us. We'd have to go back to the room. God damn it. Okay, <laughs> well, we're going back to the room to get the coffee card so we can get a free coffee. Yeah. And then we're going to get coffee. And coffee. And then after the mega deck party, we're gonna pass out. Because that's the goal. The whole point of this is to pass out. I can't walk apparently, so. It's really bright behind me. Look at that. The sun. Oh wait, no, it's not sun, it's the light. Oh the screen. Oh, look at the brightness and the funnel. Ah, okay, we're gonna get coffee. Coffee card. Promenade. Promenade. Alright. So we're back on Promenade and the music is loud. Alright. <laughs> oh hell yeah. So we are going out for the mega deck party, which, uh, <laughs> hello. <laughs> so pre-deck party fun started about 10 minutes ago. So we're gonna come out here and find a good area to stand in. in the mix with those tracks right now. Now, folks, who wants to keep a shuffle? Make some noise right now. You want to keep a shuffle? Of course you do. All right, everybody wants to. But, folks, I got to warm y'all up. So, DJ, give me this first song. We're going to get y'all going. So, come on, join us. This song's called Fireball. You don't have to take shots. Don't worry. You can if you want to. But I just want to see y'all down here. We're going to get y'all warmed up. So, let's go. Come on. We're going to take this.
Maria del Capitano. Rosa. Hello. Pizza. I've seen you get hot dogs. All right, so we are back in the cabin now after the uh, mega deck party and some pizza. Mm-hmm. Um, Anyone who likes to dance, just so you know, the Mega Deck Party is a cruise director driven party, so they kind of make up new dances to dances you already know. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I didn't have anything really to say other than I'm tired as shit, so I'm going to go to bed. <laughs> yep, we're going to get some sleep. Yep. Tomorrow is a sea day, uh, so we will be doing things around the ship mostly, um, I would hope, because we can't get off. <laughs> yep. Uh, so we're gonna we're gonna do things around the ship, and then tomorrow evening we will pack and then be getting ready to get off the boat the following day. Boo. Yep. But tomorrow should be fun, so we'll find stuff to do. Mhm. Mm so have a good night, and we'll see you in the next one.